Um, You're back. I'm back. So this is this episode eight, but it's for us, it's the second of a two part filming session. So there's less channel news to discuss because we don't know it yet. Although there probably is some major shit probably happened since we posted. In the comments, you mean? Yeah. I, I think everything's gonna be okay. It's, this is actually a fun game, because we don't know, <laughs> but it's like we can predict how people are gonna react to what we just filmed. I you mean, know what I mean? I think some, you're probably gonna get some still that are like, that disagree with you, and then probably most that are like, let them do it. Yeah, like Let you don't have to defend in. yourself. Yeah, right. Like this isn't fun when you just have to keep on fighting this fight. Right. Interesting. Can't wait to find out. Um, but I want to thank you all for being here. Let's see what location I choose for the Young Hollywood party. Mm. We stretch that fans. drama over two episodes. Yeah, it's we so high stakes. Was taking off. Normally we it was, it was taking days. off. I'd like to see 1500. Okay. And she was getting more responsibility than ever. Heidi's engagement got off to a rocky start. You can't really be mad at me. You can't? No. But she was determined to plan the perfect wedding. And with Jason back, I thought we could forget the past and start fresh. But Heidi and Spencer made sure that didn't happen. It's great to see you guys back together. It's heartwarming. Now I had no idea what Jason thought was going on between us. But I was about to find out. Ooh, muscle T. thing we're doing? I need to know because I'm really thrown no, by the No, I don't shirt. really have like too many clothes right now. I need to go shopping. Really? I do, but I have I a ton of your clothes. <laughs> By the way, thank you for all my workout t-shirts. Oh my god, you suck. Thank you. Yeah, but I, I do want you to meet my girlfriend. Go. Do you think that she had like maybe a little interest in, in getting back together with him? Um, no, I don't. But they're definitely making it seem like that yeah yeah i think they're yes really? i think yeah. they want some stakes because he's about to introduce the girlfriend she's so cool so what's her name kasha yeah we're gonna move in together red course here homemade biscuits uh homemade butter thank you but i want you to meet her i'm i want to have like a housewarming party so would you like to I would love to be there. Uh, oh, I don't. <laughs> For you. <laughs> they, they're, they're just becoming friends again. Should I do a voice? In the distance, so close to it, I'm going to release your inhibition. Feel the rain on your skin. No one else can feel it for you. Only you can let it in. No one else, no one else can speak the words on your lips. Live your life with words unspoken. The gentle words with the words unspoken. Today is where your bug begins. The rest is still unwritten. I'm gonna crush that too. For better or worse? You know, I don't feel like playing the drums. I went to lunch with Jason yesterday. You did? Mm hmm. How was that? It's good. It was kind of weird, though. I guess he has a girlfriend who he's like moving in with. Dude. What? That and was like, fast. It was just kind of like, I have a girlfriend and we're moving in. It's like, oh, wow. <laughs> I thought that was kind of weird that he didn't tell me. He wants me to meet I her. Mean, he did tell me. That was him telling you. Maybe they had been talking for a while before and he hadn't said anything yet. Yeah. I mean, and for the record, like, I get that if your ex boyfriend met up with you and said you had an ex girlfriend and that you were moving in together, it, that it would make you feel weird. Yeah. I I'd be like, I don't want to go to that party and meet her. Right. <laughs> But I, you would if, like, you wanted to be friends with your ex. Yeah, I just... I I'm sure she also, like, feels like she wants to keep him sober and, like, all those yes, things. Yes, and be a, a supportive... Thing. Right. Mm -hmm. Complicated relationship. Yeah, Whitney's coming, too. Uh -huh. Are you? Are you there? That should be fun. Where are we going? 
At the Wilshire Corridor? Big Wings? The Team Boat Closet? So you're going out on your first big photo shoot for the magazine. We're shooting a band called Red Jumpsuit Apparatus. This, this is where I met Laura Backman. There's five guys, and bands are notoriously difficult. If there's a problem, it's your problem. It's no one else's problem anymore. Take the help that you need. You'll take uh, Lauren with you. Right. Make sure that everybody acts appropriately, all right? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, I can handle it. Good. So. Yeah, yeah right. I am the fashion I coordinator. I have no choice, really, at right. this point, huh? Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, oh. <laughs> well, great. Thank Thanks. you very much. Bye. Bye. Have no choice. <laughs> I was West Coast editor of Teen Vogue, and I had a big photo shoot. I'm but not an intern anymore. You're not an intern. You're a fashion coordinator, and if, if you're the right person to be responsible for, for the shoot, fine. But I also would be like, hey, like, like I hope it goes well for the magazine, and if you need anything, let me know. Not like right, like it's all on you. But again, just stakes for the show. <laughs> Don't pull me down. Very excited. Um, yeah, but just looking. Are you excited for your dress? <laughs> oh, yeah, I can't wait. We should get you this one as the bridesmaid. I'm going to be very white. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to show you this dress. It's so pretty. I can't believe I'm really gonna be a bride soon. My heart is beating so fast. How do you feel about it though? Excited, but it's, I mean, it's way, it's, it makes it so real. Is Spencer excited? He better be. You like talk about it and you think about it when you yeah, look in the mirror and you're like, wait. Do you ever think maybe this isn't right? Oh, I don't think so. Like I believe people fall in love, but I think like at this age, it's easy to fall out of love. That's why I get scared. Obviously, you're not in the right mind frame, but for me, it's just, it's different. Like, I, I don't want to picture my life without him. Like, I would feel like my soulmate's gone. I just try not to be naive about it. Like, one of my best friends dated her boyfriend for five years. They just broke up, so. Playing one drum. Take it slow. Just one at a time. Ooh, the Magic Castle's a fun place. That is a fun place. There's your Cadillac CTS. Like down their sizes, right? Yeah, and then just take pictures of them in it. That's easy enough. Really easy. Oh my god. Ooh, how did she go? Hi. Hi, how's it going? Good, how Come are on you? In. Hi. Uh, Hi guys. Hello, I'm Whitney. Hi, Whitney. Shorts were a big thing, huh? Hi. Hi. Lauren. How's it going? Hi. All right, we have jeans for you guys to try on. Yeah. We're in a band. <laughs> there's a possibility we could sleep with you because we're in a band and we're working together and that's historically <laughs> possible and on the table. You're like, nope, I'm chewing gum. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We definitely trust you seeing from your outfit so far. Very cute. <laughs> Already starting in with the, oh my God, these dudes. 32 is what I was, here you go. You can try them. Thank you. What size are you, did you say? These are a ladies. Eight. These are girl jeans, so. So what's going on tonight? We're like, I'm confused by that. Like, Lisa Love did not prepare me for boys wearing girls' clothes, okay? And I'm on my own here, guys. What do I do? Hey, um, I think we're gonna go over to a little dive bar. Oh, really? You guys should come if you guys aren't doing anything. Yeah, I'm definitely going out. Well, I'll have to check my schedule, but. <laughs> That'll be fun to go out with tonight. Yeah, I'm excited. Do you think that's okay, though? I mean, I don't see why not. Every time there's ADR, we can just go like this. <laughs> hey, no, hey, no. The dime. We've had Been so many there. fun nights there. We had a really fun New Year's there one night. Hi, guys. Hi. Good to see you guys. Come on in. This is Andrina. How are you doing? So should we just get shots first? Do you want to take a round of shots? Yeah, let's do that, for sure. And then you guys have the photo shoot tomorrow, so I don't know how smart that is. Have you ever had a buttery nipple? I'm so sorry. Are those okay? We're at a bar. Have you ever had a redheaded slut? A few. I'm just hoping that you guys will do at least one shot with us. Just take one. I'll take one. All right. I hope I don't get wasted. No. Could you just make eye contact with her? Probably like Sophia. So I think I'm Queen Elizabeth. And now I'm stuck inside your memory. That's why it's so hot. 
That guy was nice. I like that one. Not that one? No, not the main one. So do you guys have plans? That one? That. So you guys have the photo shoot tomorrow. Like, we actually have to work it and, like, be there pretty oh, yeah, early. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know you guys probably want to go somewhere else, huh? Well, we are. You are. I mean, you guys are more than welcome to go where we're gonna go. You guys can't be late tomorrow. So are we good with Jaeger? Can we do Jaeger? Uh-oh. Oh, we only took one shot. And then what happened? We went home. I was not into those guys. Not my type. Obviously. I was in a band. Good morning. Whoa. Morning. Ruffly apron. I can't believe you got up so early. It was hard enough to Sasha Spender. Woo. I know. I just hope the band isn't late because we kept them out. Hopefully not. Otherwise, you're going to get the rap for it. I'm not going to get the rap. I'm not the boss. Whitney will, huh? <sighs> You look so tired. I am tired. You need like a power nap when you get home from work. I don't have time. Oh wait, we're going to Jason's thing tonight. Do you think it's going to be awkward? It's always weird meeting your boyfriend's ex-girlfriend. Well, and she knows you guys were together for a long time. You lived together, so. I mean, I'm going to try to be really nice to her, but I just feel like. I'm probably going to be mean to her. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that was the natural end to that sentence. Uh, well, I think she's right. more like, but it's gonna, probably going to be awkward. Fair, 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 mm -hmm. fair. I agree. I'm going to try and be nice to her, but it could be really awkward, which is a, uh, that is a completely normal reaction to the situation. Mm -hmm. I, I mean that. Faces, faces. We used to live by here, kind of. Mm -hmm. This was like on our path home every day. I remember being embarrassed that I didn't get a car wash for this no. shoot. I was like, I didn't know you guys were going to be doing a drive up. <laughs> Where's the van? I don't know. They promised they'd be here on time. I hope we don't get in trouble for keeping them out late. Hey. Where's Laura? A little late. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe they had car trouble. Oh, thank God they're here. Oh, it worked out. Whoa, how strong is that guy? I'm not seriously wearing that hat. Don't make fun of me. I'm wearing it as a... <laughs> I'm, I- Just like put on some stuff that was around. Yeah, I think I put on like, cause I, they, they were probably wearing it right, and I just like right. put it on. So and, you know, shoe, I'm like a human time. wardrobe, human wardrobe. Right. Somebody get the wax out of this candle. I cannot confirm or deny if those glasses were mine though. They're definitely yours. <laughs> Come back. I got you. And I will take care of Elias. Oh, you. Okay. You're fine. Mm -hmm. Why are you holding jeans? Oh, we want to change your jeans. No way, sorry. Really? Yeah, I really like these a lot. These are really nice, though, and they're small. They're really small. I know, but they... I don't like them because they're not mine. I really just like these a lot. Sorry. What do you suck at your I job? suck. <laughs> I suck. We drain the ocean. Oh, my God. I meet with Lisa tomorrow. I know. She'll be sounded like a little child. You do not have a future in this that you do Exactly not. like that. You do not, you do not have a future. <laughs> <laughs> you do have a future, just because you couldn't get f***ing red jumpsuit spandex <laughs> airplane to put on the jeans. I do. I like when they lean into my silliness. It makes me feel, it makes me feel like I'm watching myself. Right. Excited to go register? So excited to go register. Woo. You're always being so sarcastic. Yeah. This is China. This is what you're so excited for. Don't get that plate. This looks heavy. That's going to be an expensive one. Don't get glasses. that plate. We need glasses. We have enough glasses. What do you want? You want to register at Blockbuster? <laughs> yeah. Not happening. Blockbuster. What do you want? You want some more of these? I bet you do. Oh, I've always wanted one of these. It's the dangerous thing for you to have. Are you just over this registering? You don't want to do this? I don't know what we really need it. 
from anybody. We have everything we need. But you're the one who asked me to marry you, and you don't even seem like you're into any of this. I just think it's silly to make people buy us a bunch of stuff that we're not going to use. Oh, now you're all sad. We'll resume this on a different day. I mean, I don't blame him, like, but that was a non-scene. Good seeing you, seriously. I'm happy you came. This is cute. Oh, Adrena. Hi. How are you? Thank you. How are you? Good. There's a lot of people here. Hey, Lolo. Hey, darling. How, how are you? Good. How are you doing? Good to see you. you? Katja. Yeah. There's a ton of people here. Lauren. This is Katja. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. It's Audrina. Hi. Yeah, nice to meet you. How are you? Whoop. 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 Does it seem like he's drinking again? Her smelling the drink made me think that. Nah. But like he's just giving her a drink, so he might not be drinking. <laughs> Kasha, come over here. Let's kiss in front of my ex-girlfriend. <laughs> With my eyes open. I'm so bad on that. You okay? Major, no, it's fine. Yeah, Major. <laughs> We've got something to say. Uh, well, some of our best friends in the house right now just got engaged. Jason and Kasha, it's to you. Oh, no way. Congratulations. Good seeing you guys. Is it bad that I really want to leave? No. No, Lauren, we understand. Where's K Todd? I need air. Oh, I got the phone. Do you recognize any of these people? No. Katja is not happy. What, what's, what's that face for? <laughs> So it was not a sober situation. I think you're being an idiot, but that's your decision. What do you mean by that? Why did you get engaged? You're 20 years old. You've known me for so long. That's just like how I've been. I've always liked to be in a relationship, and I found somebody, like somebody I really, really care about. Why are you in such a hurry? When I talked to you, your parents got married at like 20 years old. They dated for six years before. They were like high school sweethearts. You didn't know her in high school. You've been dating her for like four months. Seven months. You're a big liar. Six months and some odd days. I mean, well, I just thought you'd be happy for me. You really want me to be happy for you? You don't want to be? I mean, that was kind of like, do you really want me to be happy for you with another girl? Like, uh, we're supposed to be together. Yeah, true, 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 true. Oh. Bring in Katja. Having fun, maybe? Yeah, I'm chilling. Why don't you to tell me about the world and everything? I can see how you think that I am. What? I'm her so back is awkward. Her. Congratulations. I mean, I don't know if you could fake all that. No, I don't think so. I agree that it's Jason maybe should be waiting. A yeah, longer she's award. being reasonable. And like not expect his ex-girlfriend to be happy no matter what the situation right. is, if she still has feelings. <sighs> I'm so afraid. Of feelings. No, of comments. <laughs> I know, of people's feelings. <laughs> of people's feelings in the C-section. <laughs> Just know you're not alone. I'm gonna make, make this, this place, place my your home. home. So so no, in a sound of a chain of a cat on the king. No, you're not alone. Good night. <laughs> Babe, I'm gonna make this world your home. I thought I did okay. You ran the set, you did the call sheet. I tried, yeah. I did everything yeah. that you asked. 
and diva moments? Or? Um, there was one point where one of them didn't really want to take off this pair of pants he was wearing, but... What did you do? I, I mean, I told him I understood. We had all gone out the night before. It was our way of getting to know them. That's beyond your job. Going out with them is yeah. beyond my job. Yeah, you don't do that. We wanted to entertain them, make them feel comfortable because they're only in LA for a certain amount of time. She was they probably like, that's because fine. Because mm -hmm. they were out the night before or they were late because the car didn't pick them up on time? I don't know the details okay. of why they were late. I, I just want respect on every shoot that we do. And it's very hard for them to respect you if you've been out the night before. Okay. I'm sorry. I didn't mean no, for it no, to be you know what? You just need to step it up now. As I said before, if something goes wrong on the shoot, it's your fault. Right. It's your responsibility. You need to be the boss. No, stop. Stop feeling that way. Because it's not real. Yeah, that didn't happen. Lisa Love is just playing ball, and she was being nice. I'm sure she was being... Nice you don't remember day. the conversation, do you? In here? Yeah. yeah. I'm sure she was probably, we were all, we all had the understanding that this is what she needed to say to me. Yes. But it was still hard for me to then be okay with them running with this story that I looked irresponsible because I didn't really, totally. like I wasn't being irresponsible. So that was, that's what that's was hard, hard for me. I'm sure. Imagine yeah. a storyline where they're like, you got to ditch Audrina. And right. He's like, I would never do that. Right, right. Uh, right. Oh my god, remember dogs from 2007? <laughs> Here you go, princess. Oh, me, thank you. Let me get this for you. Thanks. So, what do you want to ask me about the wedding? I was thinking maybe fall, or should we do it in the spring, or summer or winter? I need to look at some calendars. <laughs> First we're gonna step. Need to, we're gonna need to check out at least three different calendars to make sure all the dates are right. Oh my god. We're going to Tibet. We're gonna fly our whole family to Tibet. Why do we have to have our whole family there? Is your wedding? So I thought we were eloping. I want the wedding and we need to register and I want the dress and, you know, so marriage. This is what a little girl dreams of. You guys need to get on the same page. Your parents of mine if they're not even there for the actual wedding. I haven't really spoke to my parents too much about me getting married. You haven't told your parents that we're getting married? I can't believe you haven't told your parents. Why, are you embarrassed? You don't want to tell them? Embarrassed? Why would I be embarrassed? Why wouldn't you tell them? What's the, what's the answer? Hmm. So instead of answering you, can, can we just stare at each other until the music plays? <laughs> Two thousand seven dollars. So basically, I just got a nice little ass thing from <laughs> Lisa. Really? It was not really good. So I think the gist is I'll just have to do a better job next time. That's the gist. <laughs> so you seem a little dazed. I'm out of it today. What's going on? We had Jason's party last night. You're like, I know I'm supposed to ask. Oh, you met his girlfriend, right? Well, I met his fiance. Fiance? They just got engaged. Oh my know. God. I can't believe that. That's weird. Of course it's weird. You just dated him a year ago and then all of a sudden he has a fiance? Like, that it's is not so even, strange. No, it's not even weird in that way. It's just like, I think I just have an idea in my head of how I'd want my like party where I announced my engagement to be. Yeah. And it, and it, it didn't wasn't include like that. a keg or a Bob Marley poster. You know oh. what I mean? <laughs> like it was really like it was difficult. It was difficult to take seriously. You know the program he's in. He's not even supposed to be dating anyone. And like I just don't want to be the one to pick up the pieces again. And you won't. Don't let yourself be that person. Know. You know, like maybe the best thing is to not talk to him for a while and let him fall down and let him pick himself back up. Yeah, but I've seen him fall down. He falls hard. She cares about him. She does. Kind of looking around. It really just hit me all at once. I was like, this could have been me. And as much as I love Jason, I'm so glad it's not. Like, I think you're right. I think she really does love him. And like, she likes the idea of being with him, but she knows that it's just not right for her. Like, I, I she's in love with him, but she knows he's not the right person for her. I get that. I mean, 
maybe Laguna Beach is a good idea because it's more, maybe it was more real. Maybe, but more. more. I know. Why would we sign up for that? Mm -hmm. Because maybe her, maybe her, like, my whole contention is that there's something going on behind the scenes that Lauren can't talk about on camera. So her on camera behavior seems disingenuous. Mm -hmm. But I get that she can't say certain things on camera because it's out of her control. I really don't blame her for that. Mm -hmm. But maybe in Laguna Beach, there's less of that. It's possible. Yeah. I don't remember. Me either. Oh, it's over. It's over. Jason Sands, you did it again. Liz, I loved your book. <laughs> Tony, could have used a little more effort from Next you. Next time on The Hills. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, logos to Vegas. Oh my God. I gave my notice. You're serious? Just the whole Heidi situation. Who am I going to chat with? She quit yesterday. Adrena, Justin, okay. hates I'm with my us. Friends too. I'll never talk to him again. Like, oh, I'm, I'm done. What are you going to do about Brody? It's like you guys have this chemistry. Where's my birthday kiss? Yes. Wow! Yes. That seems like a really big episode. How do you feel? What do you think? I don't want to stop without having another one to go to, but... Well, maybe we've asked everybody they can give suggestions and we can see what we... What we come up with. What we come up with. You and I haven't even really sat down and, like, seriously... Oh, it's going to be we... tough to get permission. Maybe if it's something old. What about 90210? Yeah. I've never even seen 90210 before. That could be cool. That could kind of be funny. Yeah, I mean, it has to be something that, like, that has, um, like, a lot of... Controversy? Fans. No, that people really fans. love. Yeah. Because, like, nobody, nobody's going to tune in to watch us do reaction videos. Entourage? Could be kind of funny and, like... Yeah. I don't know. Let's... We'll see. We'll just spitball them. We'll spitball them. Yeah. I mean, I want to do stuff that, like, these people are into, yeah. you know? Because I want them to tank stick around yeah of course get mad at me for something else all right we'll think about it all right you guys think about it too subscribe like comment whatever it is yeah don't worry free spit freedom of speedum. freedom of speedum, speedum. <laughs> we love you